What's up everybody? So today I'm headed off to Ethos Greek Bistro up in Wilton Manor and I'm going to be trying out some pretty darn amazing Greek food. In true plastic spooning fashion, I'm not going to go eat by myself. I mean, who likes to do that? Psst. Definitely not this guy. So, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's hit the road. What's up guys, so I just got to Ethos Greek Bistro and I'm meeting up with Miri from Band Eats. When I think of Greek food in South Florida, I think of Ethos Greek Bistro. And today I'm here with the lovely Miri from Band Eats on Instagram. Hi, and we're gonna be indulging ourselves yep, in Mediterranean right. food. They're located in two locations. They have one in Coconut Creek and we're here at Milton Manors. They emphasize on healthy, conscious food, yep. and they label it with vegan, vegetarian, and gluten-free. So that's really important if you're in that diet. And the great thing about them is that they're very family-friendly. Even though we're just talking to the manager, even they're a hiring process, you have to have personality. Their personality. Yeah, you have to be friendly. <laughs> you have to be a family person. And so I, I love to support local places like this, and I'm excited to eat here. So let's go have fun. Salmon is uh, really fantastic, and the bronzini I'm having tonight, really, really excited about. I think what makes it special here is the freshness of all, all the foods and the incredible spices, I think. Hi, I'm John Cola Jr., and I am the people manager here at Ethos Greek Bistro in Wilton Manors, Florida. The main inspiration of Ethos Greek Bistro is to give a lifestyle to our community. We love to give you fresh ingredients that are hand-picked from local farms and also to give you that Mediterranean feel here in South Florida. One of my favorite and main dishes is a fresh bronzini all the way from the Mediterranean Sea. It's served with our spinach rice and grilled vegetables. Our zesty orzo paella. It's a little bit different than what you're probably used to. It's a Mediterranean paella with orzo pasta, fresh seafood with a zesty tomato sauce. This is Chef David and I'm super excited to start cooking with him and, and watch him work his magic in the kitchen. Yeah. Hello guys, we're gonna do a couple of things right now. We're gonna cook some shrimp, make some fresh seafood, and let's start. Chef David begins cooking his paella by adding mussels, shrimp, and other fresh seafood into a pan. He lets the ingredients simmer together until the flavors combine. Then he adds red peppers, green onions, and fresh garlic to bring out an extra kick of flavor the seafood needs. After that, he adds fresh orzo pasta right into the pan. It works its way into the paella, making it a little different than what you may already be used to. Then he adds some fresh Parmesan cheese on top, and he plates it. There you have an orzo paella, so fresh it smells like it came straight out of the ocean. Next on the list is the fresh bronzini with spinach rice and vegetables. Chef David starts with filleting the fish and adding the extra virgin ethos olive oil to both sides. Then, he covers the fish with sea salt. When it's put on the grill, it helps bring out the flavor of the fish. So it's cooked for about five minutes on both sides, and now we're off to the vegetables. This is kale, carrots, okay. onions, and red cabbage with fresh garlic and fresh olive oil. Okay. All right. Once it's all done, we put it onto the plate. We add a little bit extra, extra virgin olive oil. And there we have it, your fresh bronzini. Right now we're just trying the bronzini out. And this fish is so fresh, so crispy on the outside. Beautiful on the outside. 